South African pupils will soon be able to take Mandarin as an official school subject. From next year, pupils in grades 4 to 12 will have Mandarin as a second language option. CCTV's Julie Shire has more. The Department of Education has approved Mandarin as part of the South African school curriculum, a decision greatly influenced by the fact that China is South Africa's biggest trading partner. The fact that Mandarin has now been registered uh, in the list of uh, foreign languages uh, that can be offered by our schools in the uh, curricula. Um, it's, it's, it's a wonderful development for BRICS. What is important is that it's not only for trade relations, it's, it, it affords opportunities for young people in South Africa to go and serve foreign offices elsewhere uh, in the world. For over 80 years, Bilateral and cultural ties have long been in practice at Pretoria Chinese School. Here, Mandarin is compulsory language and children learn it from an early age. As of January next year, many South African state schools may look as this classroom, as pupils will be able to choose Mandarin as a second language, an important announcement that has been embraced here at Pretoria Chinese School. I think with the improvement in relations between South Africa and China, uh, and China being a major trading partner with South Africa, it's important that the children, when they go into business, are able to read and to talk Mandarin because there's no doubt that they're going to come into contact with Mandarin or Chinese business people. What makes us very happy is that the children, uh, they will feel more encouraged or more motivated that, that in the future the subject can be recognized, not just an uh, 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 extra subject they can do and maybe help them somewhere along the line, so it will be officially being recognized. In a few months, many state school students will have the same privilege to learn Mandarin, placing them at an advantage when it comes to job opportunities. Chinese is quite an important language currently because, well, China is one of the biggest countries in the world. They, it will help me to get a job quite easily because it's quite a privilege to have Chinese, so it will look good on your resume or your CV. I'm actually quite happy because at least there will be other sh um, children uh, learning Mandarin except for PCS. So whenever they need like help or whenever they like are struggling with something, then at least some of the PCS uh, students can go and help them with Chinese. Promoting Mandarin in South African schools will help strengthen relations and stimulate a cultural exchange that will further develop a solid friendship and collaboration between the two countries. Julie Shire, CCTV, Pretoria.